welcome back if you're watching this on youtube we're back with more odysseus action this will be part three because i've decided to keep these as big chunky video uploads uh probably uploading them once a week uh so i hope you enjoy your next dose of odysseus action uh we're currently in ambush stance we're trying to draw these guys out now now they're the, now they're at a full 20 stack we can't attack them because they've got a really beefy 17 stack garrison uh, which scares me. So the only other way I'd be able to beat them is if I brought up another army, which I might be able to do. I've got a chappy over here. I Can we leave? No, we're we're zero on the happiness. Maybe if I keep upgrading, that might do it. But how much are we getting from characters right now? Uh, characters are giving five. The thing is, here we can't really get... I mean, we can get the giant units, to be fair, actually. Maybe I should recruit the giants while we're here. I don't want all of the giants in an army, though. I kind of want them scattered out a bit. I feel like giant bowmen would be cool to have. Without let's get hesitation. let's get some giant bowmen in here. I was going to upgrade my temple, wasn't I? I've already set my temple to upgrade. That's good. Uh, how many turns have we got left on that? One more turn. For more favor of the gods for old Zeus. Uh, Hecatomb on Zeus in two turns. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, you only have like a bit of like fizzy... Just explode. <laughs> That's what just happened. <clears throat> ay, ay, ay. Your shubty great bows. Yeah. They've got a little bit My lost and they've ended up in Troy somehow. That That's how I imagine they're going to work. Considering this is built on the Warhammer engine as well. That should almost be a copy-paste reskin. I'd have thought. Uh, other than that, uh, what are our notifications saying? Agent not moved. That's yeah, fine. Um, We've got our uh, priestess here. Messenger of the gods. 10% chance. And I doubt there's anything that increases my favor again. Surely there's not. Although there's quite a lot of skills. Oh, favor from rituals to Ares. I'll oh, please say. Oh, where's the Zeus one though? Oh, here we go. So plus 10% of favor from rituals to Zeus. Noise. So yeah, we just want to go down to service of Zeus. Favor of the gods from rituals in own settlements. Is that everyone? Yeah, so we want to get her up to rank 8 quick. Because we've gone for Ritual of the Gods in your own settlement. Yeah, we want to specifically specifically go for the Zeus one with her. She's going to be our dedicated Priestess of Zeus. That's the plan. Uh, Devotee is a good one. Because uh, it increases happiness. Uh, local points will standing idle. What I really need, Well, what I'm going to do, I think, to improve that happiness over here is to send another Priestess over there, which we will get another capacity for when uh, we finish that Ithaca. I can get another Envoy, though, actually. Oh, boy. Oh, wait. And they're going to have a messenger of... Uh, what's it called? Messenger of Thunder trait for newly recruited agents. And, yeah, no. Descendant of Zeus is for heroes. Sweet. Sweet, 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 sweet. But, yes. Um, public order. What's the other one? Success chance of all actions. Uh, success chance of all actions. Critical success chance of all agent actions. Oh, yeah. Let's go for that. And yeah, devotee's good. But we can get an envoy. But let's recruit the envoy over here because you're much closer than going there. Oh, well, I was going to check the Trojan horse thing in the raw decrees. Yeah, let me just recruit this uh, agent, this envoy. Minus 20% to action cost. 5% success chance of, of agent actions. Plus 5% to all resources this region. Anything for happiness, that's what we really want. Influence, influence over a province. That's not bad. I'll go for you, uh, Orbus. No need to get your hand. Messenger of Thunder. So we get minus 20% action costs for this agent, minus 10% to the success chance of enemy agent actions against this agent, and plus 15% to this agent's movement range. That is grand. Yeah, over you go. If only I could. If only I could. You will. Increase production of local region, increase influence. You don't improve public order, though, I don't think. I think that's for priestesses, which makes sense. You've got to balance them, but that's fine. We'll send another one over there eventually. Uh, yes, raw decrees. Apparently in the wood bit. Here we go. Yeah, Beasts of War unlocks a Trojan horse siege tower. Own armies faction, faction wise. So we can use that against any settlement then, I guess. It costs 6,000 wood. And that says unlocks a Trojan siege tower. Is that, do I have to keep doing that to get another one? Or is that once I've unlocked it, I've got it forever? Anybody know? Um, what are we going for at the moment, actually? We're going for construction cost of all production buildings, and then we're going to go for feeding the war machine. Yeah, more food production because we want to we want to field another proper army. 
Right, let's end the turn, see what happens. The rebels took that. I can't, do it. We can't really do a huge amount. Which campaign am I enjoying most so far? I'd probably say the Odysseus one, just because I've played this is the most or the first I've got in one of my campaigns. I'm enjoying both Achilles and Hector though. Um quite a lot. I'm, I'm excited to do more Hector because we've had quite a challenging a challenging run with Hector so far. A lot of it self inflicted, but also hashtag blame Papa Priam for leading us astray. Um We don't want to accept this treaty because you're someone I'm gonna go to war with soon, so I don't want to have to worry about um relations. Oh, I've got another rebellion down here. Yikes. I need to bring my army back. They're just gonna sit there, aren't they? King Odysseus. Okay, we're gonna need to We're gonna need to leave. Just a moment. Cause I need to start this public order. And I need another army probably to take you on. You're too strong. See you, Scurry. Thanks for tuning in. Okay, let's just check something. Yeah, I can't, can't recruit an army there. That would be really OP. But that does give us a bit of vision. That's okay. We're sending my spy back to see if we can help out um, Sparta. Their garrison here is actually pretty decent. They've actually upgraded it with the guardhouse. I don't know if that's just luck or actually good AI planning because it gives them a decent defense force there. They might be able to hold their own against Troy. Against Hector of Troy, I should say. Really, Menelaus, so you should be... You need to do a wiggle. Who is this here? Salamis. I'm really not sure. Let's have a look at your diplomacy. You are... You're not like you're at war with Salamis. Yeah, I'm not really sure why you're just staying there, encamped. You just, what you just, which set one do you attack? That one. How'd it go? Is the horse only cosmetic? Uh, no, it, well, it's a, it's a horse-shaped, a horse-headed shaped siege tower. Yeah, maximum growth, because then we can get that upgraded. Ba boom right yeah bring you over here great use plus five characters buildings raw decrees I think I can probably get rid of you counts. Victory minus waits. one the truth is this is influence over target settlements what is our influence here oh we might as well A do that knowledge. only 80 food tell the people what they want to hear the minus one. When that finishes upgrading, though, that'll give us a bonus bit of happiness, I think. So we've probably got quite a few things that are giving us a boost to happiness at the moment. That's, oh, that's hitting our happiness. Merchants limited. So, yeah, we're going to lose that 70 gold that we're getting. But that'll mean that that's fine. So, yeah, this army. Great deeds. Bring you over to Ithaca, and then we'll go north with both. Sounds good. Sounds good. Portents are no mystery to you. And what should be one more turn for Hecatomb. Boom, boom, boom. Plus that. So yeah, we're, we're going to get up to Zeus worship level pretty soon, which will unlock the Minotaur. And it'll give us happiness per defensive or military alliance up to five, and plus one influence per defensive uh, or military alliance up to ten. Um, recruit rank of all units, faction-wide. Uh, yes. Let's pop that. Can you... We'd be able to reach it to recruit next turn. I wouldn't have thought because you're in force march, but I could move you to fame. So let's pop that ready for next turn then. You know, we might as well have an extra recruit uh, recruit rank on all the units. Good, 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 good. End turn. I'm good, Sniper Manic. How are you? Why can't you build any other buildings at uh, Altis? Um... What the capital? Uh, that's how our that's one of our kind of faction mechanics because we're we're coastal masters. So uh, taking any settlement that doesn't have a port, so any inland settlement, um, we can only build the mainline building up to tier five, and that's it. That's the only thing we can do. So it makes makes the Disney's campaign focus on conquering coastal regions. 
But I just gave the PC a bit of a clean. Noise. Uh, who's this? Nesta. You want nine turns of 258 stone. Uh, for nine turns of 294 wood. Um, yeah, go on then, actually. Go on. I probably should have negotiated that a little bit more, but giving them a little bit extra is always good. Construction cost of all production buildings. Huzzah. Athena, thank you for the recruitment boost. They're raiding me with seven. Battle hardened. Normal stance it. Nice. Into the settlement. Docked. And then we start recruiting. Beautiful. So we can get heavy shielded spearmen. Oh boy. Get some heavy units. And we can get some uh, some reinforced skirmish chariots. There are the regular skirmish chariots as well. But we'll go for the reinforced ones. Although we've got to remember. Well, I say that. We've got to remember we've got to be able to afford the bronze. We can afford the bronze. We've got lots. How much are we getting from diplomacy? We're actually not getting any bronze from diplomacy. It's, we're producing a lot. So we're just giving away minus 170. So that's all good. Agreed. I can only afford one. Why? Oh, because you cost so much bloody wood. Roddy Eck. Okay, let's not do that. Let's let's fill up our queue with something else first. Oh, wow. You guys cost a lot as well. A lot of gold. But give me. Give me the shinies. The spearmen are expensive with the gold cost. They are. What's their bonus? Their bonus is versus large. The slow battle speed. The, um, armored and shielded, though. They're front lines. So they will... That is a staunch line of spears. Why have I got a, me um, a penalty being applied to my melee attack? At the moment. That's what I want to know. I've got two two giant bowmen. Yeah. Uh, Island club warriors. And we've got heavy sword skirmishers. These guys are light. But that damage is pretty decent. But probably the heavy sword skirmishers are better. Although they're heavy class. But they've got good battle speed. They're just slow to move. What's their speed? 35. Yeah. Got to remember that. These guys are real slow. 28 speed. We definitely want some fast-moving stuff. Although we will have that with the chariots. Uh, we can actually get one in right now. So we might as well finish off. Yeah. Our tree getting that. We'll go for the exemplary ambushes as well. Oh, it's going to be a fun army. We've got spear runners. Experts in flanking. Yeah, it's going it's to be a nice army. We might even swap this army to Odysseus. Uh, to give him some, some new ones. Oh, losing. Yes, that's what it is. That's no what it is. He's combat. got... Touched by Phobos. Suffered a defeat in offensive battles. Yeah, so his morale's dropped, but hides behind walls. Melee attack, that's why. Because he spent multiple turns under siege. So I don't know how we lose that one, I guess. Um, by pressing the attack, it will eventually drop and disappear. Uh, Homeric character. Oh, he's always a special one. So he won't die. This character was referred to by Homer in his epic. It's cool. Uh, uh, Justin True, though. Plus two happiness. I promise. Cool, cool, cool. Can we give you anything? Oh, oh yeah. We gave we gave Odysseus uh, Heracles sword. So you can have the spear. Uh, Odysseus boar helmet. No, can't give you a mount. Follower item. None free. That's fine. You got a silver box anyway. Uh, another raw decree. I want to go for that, but I don't have enough gold. Construction time of all production buildings. Hmm. I guess I could see if I can get enough gold from someone with lots of gold. Let's have a look. Heavy skirmishes, screening, club warriors for flanking. Yeah. Can I stick heroes on chariots? I believe so. You can. I think you can. About to play your first campaign, which is the best almost fun. I mean, I've only played Odysseus, uh, Hector and Achilles so far. I would admit, I'm quite enjoying how Odysseus is quite different to the others. Um, if you don't mind island hopping, seems good fun. Um, I think, think Sparta, uh, Menelaus is a, is a nice kind of sort of fairly straightforward start. You got owned by Achilles this morning. Uh-oh, who are you playing as, Scribe? Let's find someone with loads of gold. Salamis. I don't think you'll give me everything I want. If nothing else. But how about non-aggression? Ooh, and military. Oh, no, wait. Non-aggression for some gold. Ah. I'm going to sell treaties. This kind of almost just brings back a, a throwback to like Medieval 2 where I'm, where I'm haggling for maps. Selling map info to everyone. And 
Oh, you don't want to do that now. That's fine. I want another... Uh, 222. What would you like? You'd love some bronze. You'd also love some stone. I can give you some bronze. Oh, that's not going to... I mean, that helps a bit. But you've got loads of food. I think we might have to do multiple deals with people. So, let's. See. Can I get another 100 out of you? Oh, God, that's going to cost me a lot of bronze. I mean, we are getting 316 a turn, though. Aglin all day long. Yeah, let's do it. We all did well. All right, somebody else with lots of gold. Oh, actually, ideally we should find someone who likes me. Uh, you value gold, of course you do. The Acadians, apparently you don't value gold. I'm sure Odysseus has plenty to say of service to us both. You value bronze, though. Everybody values bronze. Ooh. I don't want to give away that much, actually. Let's find somebody else who's got a bigger stockpile of gold. Yeah, I don't want to treat with them because I want to kill them soon. Oh, hell, hell, whoa. Esperia, you are flush with the gold. 1,500. We can both behave like reasonable people. Oh, wow. I could, should have come to you. I'm going to take all your gold for this, though. That I can get. 277. I think... Oh. I'm not planning on killing you, am I? You're over there. You've got, you got a lot of land. But yeah, I'm not planning on killing you just yet. How much land have you got? Three. Cool, cool, cool. How's Sparta doing? We're cheering a little bit. Cassini, um, I haven't gone I for yeah, military all... alliance yet. Talking now avoids suffering later. Do, 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 do. Right, so we've got all the gold, which means we can now do feeding the war machine. Single turn gives us another uh, 560 food per turn, which would be good for keeping up with our army. Which is what we need. So yeah, we're ignoring them for a little bit. Uh, we'll go over here. In fact, I can probably force march now. Oh no, we are force march. There we go. Always with honor. Two turns. End turn. Played as Achilles, made everyone mad. Ah, nice. Uh, no, there are there are no naval battles. Naval battles, if you if you end up getting attacked in the water, it's an island battle system like in Warhammer. Hello, you guys. You want me bronze? Yeah, everybody wants me bronze. No. <clears throat> uh, no, no treaty with you because oh, it's an ultimatum. Oh, the other side will immediately declare war on you. Um, I mean, that's fine because I want to go to war with you. This is just a little bit sooner than I than I hope, but I'm bringing my armies down this way anyway. Sweet. Yeah, uh, no, decline. You can declare war on me. I don't have to worry about the, about waiting or I think we had some kind of treaty with you at some point. You're attacking me with all those veteran bowmen. Um, ambushes. I don't think we can win. The last time we fought an army like this, uh, they did manage to plow through. But let's try. Let's do eat.
Right, where are they? They're over here. Choke points galore. Uh, we'll want to probably flank on out. Oh, they've got chariots. Again. Oh, God. Chariots destroyed us last time. Okay. Javelins on the chariots. Otherwise, we're dead. <laughs> oh, God. Um, Islanders to try and... Oh, chariots. It's going to hurt. Uh, with the myth units in the game, can you play without ever getting using them or do you need them to complete the campaign? I mean, I've not played all the way through, so I don't know if you need them later on. But I highly doubt you have to get them. Like, if you don't want to recruit them, you don't need to use them. Um, you do sometimes get automatically spawned like an epic hero, like a Gorgon or something. But you can decide to just, you know, not use them on anything. So, um... So yeah, I don't think you're ever forced to have to use the mythic units if you don't want to. Ready. Uh, I know we want you guys flanking, don't we? Have you guys going to the tall grass? Uh, I was going here, so we're going to need the javelins, probably. Here. I might send out my hero out in front to try and stop the cavalry charge coming on through. Later again, screw work. Hey, baby, we're on a gaming. Is it possible to change the unit size? I'm pretty sure you can change it, but your units won't automate. Any units you've already recruited won't instantly jump up to the new unit size, but any new recruits, any new units you do then recruit will be at the increased unit size think that's how that's how it's worked in the past with previous total wars so i would imagine that's how it'll work in uh in troy as well the foe has sighted your hidden units yes yeah, so we've got to focus on those chariots and those archers as well Get chariots on a hector campaign. Yeah, I think I think we'll be okay on the hector campaign. To be perfectly honest, I don't think it's um, I think it's recoverable. I think we're going to be okay. Try and trap those archers between my two spears coming in. Javelins try and take out the chariots. You guys going to have your jewel. Not the right type to fight him, really, but... Your warriors oh, losing yeah. Hearts. That's a straight break. Send in the chariots like that. That'll do it. If we time this well, we can smush those archers between my two units of spears. I don't think that unit at the back is going to be here in time. Uh, although we might be faster than they are, in which case we'll pin them. Yeah, there we go. Okay, chariots are broken. Keep firing. Ambushes move this way. I definitely want those chariots dead, never to return. You guys keep flanking around here, please. Yeah, good. Keep going. Good, 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 good. Who's the target? They've gone. Nice. Javelin's over there. Come on, guys. I need you to harass their flank. All that one gives up. Does your mother know you're out? Nice. Bit of banter. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. I've got this. Your warriors have been broken. That uh, is fine, though. Break the club, warriors. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. No play with different unit sizes. I wonder what affects balance single model units. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know quite what it, how they sort of balance that all out. But I always like playing with the, the largest number of units I can possibly get. 
So for this, it's extreme unit size. By Ares, yeah, that was a good charge. Yes, by Ares. Right, shoot him. Yeah, have him in the loose spacing island skirmishes. And then you guys should be able to oh, fire. I don't know if you can, though. You might need to flank. Those archers have come back. Warriors are rallying. Head back over here. All right, those archers have gone. No point chasing those archers away because I just keep on running. So you guys form up over here and go for a flank. I think we've got to do now is just keep hitting you. Jabs. I think we're going to win. This is good though, dealing with the rebels. Yeah, for me, this is the this is the, the most optimized total war game. Your units has no more I get the highest FPS in this compared to any other total war, and I'm running this on higher settings than I run uh, other total wars as well. Like normally, I'm, I mean, I run every total war basically on ultra, but usually I have to run with shadows set to medium. But on this, I'm able to run it at ultra with higher FPS than medium Hades shadows on Warhammer 2 Three Kingdoms and at extreme unit sizes. Enemy heroes down. Nice, we won this. Yep, bounce pat. Big swing. Oh, we did all right then. There we go. Victory is close enough to taste. I don't like that they move the minimap down here on the right. What was wrong with it being up here? Top right. Why is it bottom right now? Stop shifting minimaps around. <laughs> or at least have an option of where to display it. That would be kind of cool. Might as well chase them down a little bit. Bottom right, old. Uh, I've gotten I've gotten used to it being all at the top right though. I kind of feel that makes more sense as well. Like that's an easier glance for me, personally, I guess. Then I guess it's they put it down on the same row as your unit icons, your unit bar. I don't tend to look down there too much though. I probably should. <laughs> uh, there is, there's the centaur runners, but yeah, the cavalry is very limited in this game to sort of reflect that this period there weren't many. Um, trained in the art of cavalry warfare, I guess. I don't know. Maybe bottom right is more comfortable. I'm just just used to looking at that top right section for a quick glance at the mini map, I guess. But over time, I'll get used to it. Um, no, I'm going to lives as bar to them. Oh, we destroyed everyone except the young spears and the bowmen. Beautiful. Yeah, you've got you've got chariots. I've got I've got chariots recruiting now. Feeding the war machine. Beautiful. That cannot be done. So yeah, they've declared war on me. Which is honestly fine. Very happy to be at war with them. They've only got the one settlement. That's the one settlement. Well, one of the settlements I need to complete my province. That's the provincial capital. So that's all good. Um public order here, minus one. Oh, the rebels over here, but I don't think we're going to be able to do anything different. I think I'm honestly just going to ignore those rebels for the moment. And go over here instead. Uh, I can't see if they've got an army coming in from there. So, you know what? I won't go into Force March. I'll hold here. Right. We want to get another unit of the reinforced skirmish chariots. I, I think we'll just Agreed. get two, though. I don't think we want any more than that. Uh, Spearman, I'd want at least one more. Um, and then I'm thinking two units of the heavy sword skirmishes, and then we'll go for some island club warriors. Maybe four of them, two on each flank for speed. Although, 
do I mm, might just uh, what's their speed their speed is 48 they're light what are these guys speed 55 okay and yeah, no, I'm not gonna bother with the club warriors then I'm gonna go for the spear runners for the flankers maybe more shielded spears probably focus on more heavy sword skirmishes then actually yeah but spear runners four of them to flank so four of them will take us up to 15 then we want oh actually yeah there's probably just four of them and we want four exemplary ambushes and that will leave a slot free to then actually recruit the minotaur which we should be able to get next turn when that temple of zeus finishes that will give us enough favor to get a minotaur hero yeah keep leveling yourself up or gaining experience uh how is public order here plus one all good Oh, goody, good, 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 good. Uh, you can be upgraded, as can you, for more food. What are we? I'm probably going to just, yeah, more food right now because we're doing all the extra recruitment right now. Raw decree available. Uh, construction time for buildings, holdout. That is wood construction cost faction wide. That is favor gain from a hecatomb. Cost of a hecatomb. That we need stone for. Upkeep cost for all units, own armies, faction wide, rationing. And that is casualty replenishment. I'll start looking at all these things. Just yet. Da, 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 da. Plus 15% to, to melee attack of all medium infantry units, own armies, faction wide. That's more bronze. I feel like upkeep cost reduction would be good. So let's go for fleet footed, then into fleet footed resilience, and then into that. So set that. That's going to be 12 turns. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Does this tech game have towers for sieges? Uh, for for wall settlements, your minor settlements can never have walls or or towers. Um, the garrison building in minor settlements, there it, it just gives you garrison. It doesn't provide any walls. Again, I guess to reflect the period that uh, at this time, you know, not every settlement had had walls. It was primarily oh wow look at them they've united agamemnon sent some forces down here push back hector's force nice they might reclaim sparta that'd be interesting is menelaus still up here he's building up an army slowly so maybe when he gets to a full 20 stack he'll move again kind of got stuck there though menelaus is so but surely expanding though he's starting to he's starting to get strong and then i guess he'll launch his counter attack on uh, on troy yeah, that's interesting. Cool. We seem not be getting completely wiped out, though. That's good. But yeah, I guess it's to reflect that at this time, you know, you probably wouldn't... Not every settlement would be walled up. So they just have the provincial capitals as uh, walled settlements. How many starting habits? Yeah, so yeah, there's eight. As uh, as Rallis said. Four Greek, four Trojan. Uh, war machines yeah, you can get rams and then it, once you unlock the uh the trojan horse you get a, a horse headed um siege tower you can utilize as well but that's it other than that you've got ladders that will instantly spawn the pier on all units um Mm -mm -mm -mm. Lone wolf, who are you? Oh, you want peace? You're the ones I... Why are you... Hang You're not zooming to location. Your location is sort of over here. Is that why? If I click on you again? Yes, there we go. Now it's working. You want you want peace. Now, I want to take you out. Um, That's kind of cute that you, you're offering me peace when you're actually probably a bit stronger than me right now. You guys get order resolved because Odysseus is reinforcing. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's definitely better than Thrones, in my opinion. I mean, the, the pacing, just just on the pacing, it's way better. Because there's garrisons in minor settlements, so you can't just steamroll your way through as easily. Colt, level up. 
Portents in the sky. Plus 50% to recruitment cost of all army units. Oh, no, seriously, that's not what we need right now. And we're negative. Food. Minus four. Uh, oh, is that... Oh, only armies in this region. Oh, that's, that's there. Oh, no, that's not the region we're in. So we're okay. Poison the well failure. Beautiful. Silver box. Ancillary gain. Plus five influence this province. And this is steadfast. I'm a rock. I am an island. Plus three percent to melee defense for units. A seasoned warrior. Beautiful. I've got one silver box. Can I? I'm guessing I can't add two silver boxes. No. Sad times. Can I give Odysseus a silver box? Oh, wrong bit. Silver box. Boom. Huzzah! Right, so we've now got Zeus up to worship level. Uh, we decay by 10 per turn, so we need to keep on doing that uh, favor to the gods and a hecatomb. After a while, we just need to keep doing the priest, and she'll keep it topped off over 600. So we've now got unlocked recruitment of Minotaur, faction wide, plus one to happiness per defensive alliance, uh, per, per defensive or military alliance, uh, up to five, and plus one to influence per defensive or military alliance, up to 10. So that gives us a nice boost. And that'll be from faction. Yeah, plus one. Does it tell me how much we've got here? No, it just gives me the whole total. Uh, yeah, food's in the negative. We are... I was upgrading some food somewhere. Was it over here? Yes, we're upgrading that food. And we've got that one we can upgrade. For that, though, we need more gold to be able to upgrade it. Uh, which will give us a bit more food. I might just go see... Have we got anything in diplomacy? No, we've got no diplomatic deals for more food. I know exactly who's going to give us loads more food. Agamemnon with 40k food. I know that wars can also be won off the battle. Um, I think you'll give me the... Ooh. Oh, okay, that's that's too much. Um, You value all the rest a fair bit. Bronze is always good to throw away, he says. Oh, wow. Look at that drop, though. Look how much he values bronze, though. For 10 turns, 100 of it. How much am I getting per turn? 234. <sighs> he also values stone. How much stone am I getting a turn? Mm, 140. That would be most of my bronze gone, though. Love the bartering resources. Yeah, I really like it. I, like, I, I mean, some people might find it a bit annoying that pretty much every turn, you probably do need to do some kind of it to really min-max it. Or not necessarily every turn, I guess, as things go on. But maybe eventually every five to ten turns to just refresh your barter agreements, things like that. Um, I, I like it, though. Rather than just having a, a background trade agreement just ticking through, I like that you actually have to work out what you need at a specific point, and that will change as you progress through the campaign. Does he value? I wonder if I can do it with wood. I wonder if I offer 100 bronze. Because so I've got a lot of wood coming in. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. I've got a lot of that. Oh, but that's only for 7 turns. Oh, there we go. 10 turns. For 1,000 food. 10 turns. Beautiful. Set. Thanks, Aggie. Uh, I did want some did want some gold actually, so I could upgrade that straight away. We've got stone. It would be almost stone, pretty much. But it gives us a lot more food. Uh, who was it that's really flush with gold? It was. Um, down with an E. These guys. Let's bear up. Yeah, look at that gold. Let's talk things over while we can. Give me a hundred. What do you want? You want bronze? Of course, you want bronze. can't trade away the stone because I need that. Uh, okay, let's lower the amount of gold because I don't need all of that. I need six. Yeah, 60 will do. Oh, there we go. We can lower the bronze a bit.
40, 244, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. No, it's dead on 50. No, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There we go. Boom. Thank you. Right. Upgrade you. Give me that food. Om nom nom. Ever faithful. That's your army over there. You're wandering through somebody else's territory. I do that. Yeah, you, you shouldn't be doing that. They're very Not naughty. Let's try... I mean, what's the, the route you're going to go? Let's try and set up an ambush. If we go in the forest here... Heading out. Prepare I have heard the ambush maps in this game are meant to be spectacular. I've not experienced one yet. I'll win or die to, to know what they're like. But hopefully we'll get to see soon. Okay. I am. Come on, Menelaus. Start reclaiming your land. I'm wavering oh, we need to recruit more troops, don't we? Uh, so, I was going to go for you guys, but we need gold. No. Okay, the javelins. No, we need gold. Damn it. Ah, oh, son of a biscuit. Let's go to somebody else that's got gold. Because those guys just want all my bronze. I mean, everybody wants my bronze. It's a curse with all this bronze. I need somebody else that's got all the gold. That I can maybe make a better deal with. Yeah, you guys will do. You do value the bronze, though. Ah, son of a biscuit. I suppose we may as well talk. I should probably do some quick deals. Oh, crap. Really? 100 gold? Oh, but 100... 100 wow, yeah. Um... I don't want to. We need bronze to recruit stuff. Let's decline. Let's go quick deal. And just I hope do this for lots of gold. Me. Yep. Um. Yeah, I'll take your stone as well. And go. Boom. I will do. No, don't want non-aggression with you. Don't want non-aggression with you. Athens. Actually, I didn't check to see those people I've just signed non-aggression with. Um, where are they? Uh, over here. Are you at war with anyone? Uh, you've got non-aggression with Pythia. Or Pythia, rather. That's fine. Yeah, don't want with you. Don't want with you guys. You are at war with Salamis. Let's turn to the Arcadians here. We don't do that. We don't upset the Arcadians. Hector of Troy. <laughs> no non-aggression pack there. Military access. Yeah. You've got a bit of gold. Uh, you're pretty tiny and you're at war with a couple of factions, so you probably will die. Odysseus is wise and deserves to be heard. Good. Yeah, give me your gold. Thank you. Agree. Uh, probably still want a bit more gold. Nobody else wants military axe, so defensive alliance. No, we can't push that anywhere. Confederation can't do that. Uh, we, <laughs> we could peace out with you guys. But I don't want to. Uh, I was going to check, actually, yeah, the Arcadians. You've got a lot of gold. I'm sure Odysseus has plenty to say of service. So I really want that region. I need to conquer another region and give it to you at some point. Uh, oh, that's what I was going to do. But Oh, yeah, they had another territory over there, but they've lost it. That's what I was going to do. That's my master plan. Lost. Oh, wait, well, I can't trade it to them. I've got to do it. Only, you can only trade territory that borders them. Dang it. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Gold. Everyone loves gold. Gold is needed. Hagel Heart is back. Uh, is this as good as Rome 2? Um... I mean, I have a lot of problems with just there being a lot of legacy issues with Rome 2 that obviously, no matter how much patching they do, it can't be fixed, which has, to a degree, been improved in future Turtle Wars. It doesn't have the scope and scale of Rome 2. There's certain things I like better in Troy compared to Rome 2. Uh, I mean, uh, I like Rome 2 for different reasons to, ha to what I like about Troy, I guess. There's a more developed campaign map here, but I like, I like the factions and the, the scope and scale of Rome 2. Uh, in terms of what I can get out of it. But having said that, I've played Rome 2 to death now. And I don't think I'll be going back to it anytime soon. 
So right now, if you said you've got to play one or the other, Rome 2 or Troy, I'd pick Troy. Not saying it is better, but just from what I'm what I'm currently into, uh, I don't really have much interest in going back to Rome 2 right now. Um, yeah, so I want gold. Oh, you're going to want bronze, aren't you? Uh, of course you want bronze. Yeah, no. Okay, let's just let's just see what we can recruit with what gold we've got now. I think that might be our limit. Victory oh, we can get we can get a minotaur now. Oh boy, can get you in there. Uh, I won't get you just yet though, because you only cost food. Kind of feels like an asset flip. I wish they had modernized the UI like into the kingdoms. I don't know. I, I don't really have an issue with this with this UI to be honest. I, I find it fairly functional. What what do you what do you what do you miss? Um, what do you find is lacking in the Troy UI? Just out of interest. Um, just picked up another two tubs of sneak. Not running low. Just found um, two new fave flavors. Awesome. What 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 are those? Bay Runner Gaming. Clarity. I mean, I don't. I don't find any of this not clear, to be honest. I mean, personally, I'm. I'm not a big fan of. of I. I don't like. I don't necessarily like the Three Kingdoms one, but I think that's because I don't like the fact that you've got to have it. I don't like the Three Kingdoms recruitment. Um, where you've got to have it set to a character and like it's sort of their retinues. I don't think that works, to be honest. Like that guy costs more food than the entire army. Yeah, he's a he's a big. You got well, you got to, you got to feed your minotaurs, haven't you? Uh, anyway, oh god, they cost ninety four gold. These guys. Okay, I might not go for the exemplary ones. I think we might just go for the regular ones because they're much cheaper. Uh, they also cost bronze upkeep, which actually isn't too big of a deal. But oh, you're expensive. Uh, how much do these guys cost? The spear runners. Yeah, I was going to get a load of you. I can get three. That's all we'll do then for now. Just get three. I have a plan. Ambush, see how that goes. You've got three more turns. And end it. I like like not being able to at a glance tell if they're ally or enemy. Oh what the the factions with their colouring. Okay, yeah, that's that's yeah, that, that's fair. I mean I, I I always kind of think of the UI as in like selecting your units and stuff. But yeah. Stuff like that, sure. I don't. I don't mean I don't like the necessarily the user interface for like recruiting and stuff and armies in 3K. I think is my my biggest thing. But yeah, a lot a lot of it early on is you'll you'll be very set in your ways of um. I don't want you. Very set in your ways of whatever total war you've been previously playing and what you're used to, and getting used to a new one. It always takes me a good like week or two to kind of really start settling into the the UI of a total war game. You're going to go up there, aren't you? Yes. I really want to get an ambush going, guys. Foes, beware. They're trying to flank on round to go for that settlement. I mean, I could I could just go hit that and wipe them out. What, what's our garrison up here? It's eight. We get he heavy sword skirmishers. Ruddy egg. What have we done to get that? Is it because it's just tier three? And that's what we get. Yeah. What have they got? I'll have to refuse. It should have been okay. One of their units is a priest. Is that yeah? Does it? Oh, does a hero take up a slot in an army? Actually, victory awaits. Advance. No. Great. Good. Deeds. We're gonna say surely not because they don't appear on the campaign map. Allow me to uncover what lies ahead. Okay, no. So it's still nine nine actual I units. Uh, I don't know. I reckon we'll be okay. I am going to in that case strike at their at the heart of their lands. Then I'm gonna take out their their settlement unless it, oh it's got a 15 garrison okay no i'm gonna re i'm gonna break their army first i'm gonna break their army um well i think that garrison can still take care of itself actually i'm gonna i'm gonna just jump in here the extra replenishment that's what i'm gonna do Da, 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 da. 
faction and city management isn't easy. I guess for city management, I'm fairly used to it because it's, it's just the same as Warhammer. That's the, the total war I've played the most of. Uh, not saying that's necessarily the, the best. It would be it would be nice to see some kind of. Uh, I mean, what do people think of the, the building process in Three Kingdoms? Actually, construction because it wasn't. It was just kind of. It was. It, it was it was kind of a tweak to Warhammer system, whereas this is basically pretty much the same format as Warhammer's, just updated with with Greek and Trojan buildings, right? Welcome, Bandit Goat. And you just got tubs of cherry bomb blue raspberry. Oh, nice. Enjoy. Uh, right, what are we going for with you? We are going for plus 10% to all resources one local province while standing idle. That means not in the army, right? So we don't want that one. Agent cost, movement range. I don't think I want to go for that. We'll wait probably to tier 5. We can upgrade. We've gone for Stargazer. Agents movement range. No, I don't want that. Uh, influence. Upon successful action on settlement. No, I don't really want any of that. I think I might just I might just save that point until we next level up. I don't really want any of that stuff right now. Although I don't think I want any of that. Next or battle speed of all units. Oh no, minus ten percent. Hmm. I just want stuff for while you're in in my army. Embedded movement. Yeah, I might just save it for a few levels and then just blast through a few items when we level up. A few items, a few skills. Wisdom what else have we got? Uh, yeah, you've upgraded. That's you. You've not moved. A few turns. Well versed in we combat. are going to recruit another unit of the spear runners, but we can't afford to because we're out of gold. Or gold needed. Uh, at bronze. Okie dokie. We need one more unit of them, and then we want the, the javelins. Can I get any of the javelins? I can get the ambushers. Right one. Oh, yeah, yeah. We need we need more gold. I've got to work out something for a gold. Warwick! Thank you very much for gifting five tier one subs. Much appreciated. <laughs> Cheer off your face. Uh, did shot. Okay, are you saying goodnight? If, if so, good night. Have a good one. Of You're over here. Keep doing that. I'll keep them happy enough. Keep them happy. Keep doing stuff. Um, won't build anything there because I don't know if I need to trade it away. Yeah, in a minute, or more gold. I find a gold settlement to cotton cut. Yeah, well, I want I want that one from the Arcadians, but I don't want to go to war with them. Um, I don't know if there's a gold settlement up here, there is a gold settlement up here. Okay, I mean, I'm going after them soon. It's just I wanted to have both armies ready to finish this one off first. Um, let's just go back. Let's see if there's anyone on quick deals. You're at war with the Arcadians. I don't really want to do that because you don't have much gold. You guys want military access, and you're at war with some of the people I'm about to go to war with. Um, I've already got non-aggression with you, so yeah, you know what? This should be interesting, if nothing else. Give me gold. You've got loads of bronze, so you don't care about that. That's good. That's refreshing. You like having food, though. All right. Boom. That should give me enough of my a noble warrior. Uh, my ambushes, I think. Quite so. Yeah, four of them. Uh, then we need one more spear. For which it's the gold, but I'll be able to get that off somebody with the barter next turn, and then Minotaur Perfecto. Beautiful. Is the map a bit small? Uh, no, I think it's a good size. Again, for a saga game, it's a smaller map focus. I think it's actually alright. This insta. One in the north as well. 
Uh, that's the one, yeah. That's the one I, yeah, I just hopped over. Yeah. Odysseus the Cunning. Ah, uh, yeah, so replenishing. Odysseus. How many skill points? Fine. What's happening here? It will be epic. Menelaus, he's sailing back. Yay, finally. Those who oppose me need Hades. We head down to Etis, see what's going on there. Sweet. Right, uh, place to upgrade. You want more wood? Got a lot. It's probably more food I need to think about. Anywhere with more food. Or a port. Actually, I saw a port somewhere. Yep. Port will do more food. Do that. How long until we get our food boost here? Two turns and four turns. Okie dokie. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. Ah, and hot stretch. Guessing armies with blue icons are allies. Uh, I think so. How do you maximize divine will? It's the one mechanic I'm trying to understand. Um, basically, you want to look at... You, uh, I mean, take into account if there's any bonuses to uh, any of the unit types uh, playing as a specific character. So, um, I believe Odysseus, we, we have a focus on kind of unique javelin units. So for javelin units, you want Zeus because he gives, uh, as you can see, plus 15% to missile damage javelin units. Also, if you had uh, a faction that gave a bonus to club units, you'd also want to consider going for Zeus because he gives plus 20% to melee attack of club units. But mainly, just look at the type of units you want to field and go for the combination of probably two or three gods that will boost them the most. Uh, Athena's always good because she does uh, spear boosting and you'll probably have a fair, lot of, a fair amount of spears. Uh, Ares for swords, uh, Zeus for clubs. And then look at the prayers. Like, the prayer to Aphrodite is good early game. So that gives you a bit of happiness and growth. Um, so, yeah, basically kind of have a, have a look through what their first tier is. And also then plan out the second and third tier of their, their favor gain to work out your particular playstyle, what units you want to specifically recruit, if there's any units that are worth recruiting specifically for the faction, the character you're playing as, because they get existing buffs and bonuses um, playing as them, then that, that's the way I would sort of tweak it and shape it. Ultimately, though, you can go for whatever god you like, um, whatever whatever gives you the buff and bonus that you most want at that time. The best way to gain favor, build some temples, heck a tomb as much as possible, get a priestess out, and just keep having that priestess uh, use their ability on your settlement with the templing because that gives you extra favor every time you do that and it will slowly build on up anyway we're going to dive on in and fight this battle it's our garrison against um uh these guys the uh tolians uh, they're attacking our settlement that's fine we've got heavy sword skirmishers island club warriors ambushers heavy island skirmishers and renowned slingers their shield of spearmen a bit nasty but we should be okay Club warriors and they've got slingers. Do it. I have to play the happiness because Achilles mood swings. Yeah, so there's 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 a couple of ways you can gain happiness. I mean, Zeus gives happiness at its third tier, down to the number of military alliances or defensive alliances you have. Um, for happiness, though, I think that's mainly through Aphrodite. She's kind of your best one for just pure gains for that. Uh, but happiness gains, just make sure you go for the happiness building. Um, that's how I've done it in my Achilles campaign on YouTube so far. If you haven't already checked out the, my Achilles YouTube video, feel free to, to check out. I've got two uploads of that out already. Uh, and this afternoon, I'll be releasing part three. Uh, and I, I'm roughly managing the happiness of it um, pretty well. Is that... Oh, there's, no, there's entry points over here, but this is going to be the main funnel choke point you're going to deploy down. Beautiful. Thank you. That's great. That's great. Alexandros, you will hold here. Uh, oh, we can. Oh, we got Vanguard deployment. Beautiful. Just with these guys, though. Oh, and the sword skirmishers. Um. They're hidden. There. I'm gonna have you out here to then just harass. Problem is, I need to get you probably in the in the trees as quickly as possible. Heavy island skirmishers. What I'll do with you guys is have you lot. Uh, no, I won't have you there. I'll have you. 
over here and I'll flank on out. Uh, actually, no. I lie. I lie completely. I'm going to have you guys all out here as well. Maybe. Mm, there is some grass I can run you into. It's not tall grass, though, I don't think. Because mm. I reckon we've got enough units here to hold. Maybe not, though, actually. Taking all three of them. That might be a bit ballsy. We want the slingers that way. We go out this way. There is a there is a little bridge there. That's quite a way. We better fall back. At this point, we can hold all the way back there. Um, not so bad now, but mid game. Oh, okay. Yeah, I might have to check that out. I'm gonna pull you guys back because I'm probably gonna need you guys. Guessing. We'll probably fall back from the main point and we'll hold extra points here and just pull them back to us. We'll use the Island Club Warriors to start with. Um, heavy javelin skimmer. I don't know if they're going to get round in time, but we'll we'll try. Give it a go. Has it happened to you that factions with whom you have a non-aggression pact still declare war uh, at you at no apparent reason? It happens a lot. Stop my Achilles campaign. Uh, I've not had anyone with a non-aggression pack do it to me yet. Sacrifice, thank you very much for subscribing with tier one sub. Much appreciated. <laughs> Draw off your face. Yeah, I haven't, haven't, haven't had it happen in my Achilles campaign yet. But you never know. It's still early days for that one. Use the sword. Get your swords out. Prepare for battle. Uh oh, I need to put the sword down. Get back, slingers. Hold. Go. Hit those slingers. Rest of you guys just hold back here. Right, more sword waggling. Waggle, 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 waggle. Your warriors are losing heart. Yep. It's all right. They're doing what I need them to do, which is just hold them for long enough. Go, javelins, go. Next unit of slingers is there. They come. Run, slingers, run. I should have pulled you back a little bit sooner. take these guys out we can move in behind with the javelins and hopefully wreck these guys your hero is under attack poseidon of brucians that is a fantastic name thank you very much for subscribing with uh prime sub <laughs> you're off your face hey read the tard how you doing Oh. The foe has sighted your hidden okay. units. Push them off. Yeah, you might as well stay engaged. I'm gonna go break these guys over here first. Yeah, so you've got you've got 22 minutes still to claim Total War Saga Troy for free. Keep forever. 
After that, it will cost monies. So kind of ding, 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 last call if you want to get the game for free. Make sure you pick it up. If you're watching this on YouTube, I'm afraid the time has definitely passed. Actually, no. Pull you out this way and shoot him in the back. Your warriors have been oh, no, he's broken. Yeah, pulled through, routed. Oh, look at the javelins absolutely melting them. As they should do, they've got their backs turned. Just reminding all my friends in our WhatsApp group that last call, go grab it. <laughs> Your YouTube is literally just ripped from the stream. Nice. Uh, no, I have. Uh, it's not. It's not just um, uploads of, of my Twitch streams. I, I I aim to do four regular series a week, um, uploaded three times a week each, on my YouTube channel. Uh, two of my current series are dedicated just uh, videos that I record uh, for YouTube exclusively, and then two series are series that I make from recording my live streams and uploading them to YouTube afterwards. Uh, and then I do have a couple of extra series from extra live streams and one-off videos and things like that. So at the moment, we're kind of 50-50 on content, basically. Go hit them there. Yeah, javelins just keep unleashing the pounding. Oh, nice. They've all just broken. Charge into them. Cut them down. I'm going to make sure these guys are breaking. Yeah, you don't need to download the game to claim it. You just need to to claim it in the store. You can do it on a browser. Ah, oh, damn it. They beat the Club Warriors broke me. That's fine. Heavy island skirmishes. Go take them out. Rally troops here might push me back through, but I should be okay. This guy's got still got a decent amount of ammo. If these guys can shatter after a volley, 
not used up all my ammo, then we'll be okay. No, that's not good. It's fine. We're doing enough damage to kill their hero. Or at least break him, I'd have thought. Try and stop their charge. Ah, no. Didn't react quickly enough. Oh, you can Aristia, though. There we go. Power of the gods. In fact, go and attack that one. You guys turn around. Go duel him while well, you got the power of the gods on your side. That's it. Big old hit. Come on, finish him. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. Oh, come on, finish him. Finish him. Get him. Nice. Come on, that's got to be it. No. Come on. One more stab. Oh, he's broken. No, come on, finish him. Oh, I wanted to finish him off. I need one more hit. Get him. Yeah, they're going to break now. Yep. Come back here. You'll die. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. Die. Now you're dead. Oh, boy. Yep, 15 minutes left to claim Troy for free. Uh, yeah, we'll live Sparta. Peace Treaty and Wood. Um, no, you're, you're still these guys over here. And I'm planning on going to kill you when I have my other army up and running. So no, let's see your only settlement. The Tin Traders. Uh, I can't do that because I don't have enough gold. Or allow trade. Which we, oh, perfect. Flourishing trade. It only costs me minus 10 influence faction wide for four turns. But we get plus 300 food per turn, plus 50 gold per turn. Plus 120 stone per turn and plus 150 wood per turn. Another event. Traders from faraway lands request permission to ply their trade within the borders of your kingdom. They sell tin, a rare but critical component in bronze making, which would surely give an edge to whoever controls its flow. So yeah, if we wanted the gift of tin, it would be for a single turn, plus 15% bronze per turn and plus 300 bronze per turn faction wide at the cost of 200 gold. But yeah, it was allowed trade. We'll allow trade. So that's what we need right now. We're good. We're good on bronze. We're good on bronze. Good, 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 good. Having low frame rate issues. How do you fix that? Uh, what's your PC spec, Joshua, for the Empire? I'll have to refuse. Uh, we're basically at full strength, so I can go. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go raid them. Ever. Because that will give us 53 food, 303 wood, 101 marble, uh, 11 bronze, and 14 gold. I kind of feel like if we're raiding, I've never really thought in history or just, you know, an army raiding going, oh, you know what we really need, guys? We need to get some stone. We need to get some... But yeah, not marble. We need to get some, we need to make sure we get some stone while we're out raiding. You know, give us your trinkets. Oh, and, and, and your stone fireplace. Come on. Come on. Bring your stone stall over. I can understand like gold and bronze, but then I, I don't know if it's too di if it's too difficult getting the other resources. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so if you have already already have epic and already play, 
Connie's, if you've if you've downloaded the game, if you've claimed the game, you've got it. It's yours forever. Yeah, once once you once you claim it's you've got it. They're not taking it away. It's not it's not free just for the last twenty four hours. It's it's free forever. It was just free to claim forever for the first twenty four hours, and then it costs. Uh, we can get more food here. Oh, we can't get that because we need stone. Uh, that's bronze. Yeah, it'll probably be worth upgrading. Da, 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 da. Great deeds await. Right, we want one more spear runner, for which I need a teeny tiny bit more gold. Hey Sparta, how it you doing? It is do? good to talk with one who does not act in haste. Let me take, oh. Give me however much free gold you want to give me. Because you're my friend. And friends give friends gold. I Cheers, babe. Uh, send the spy over here so I can see anything happening. Come on, go go smack their faces. Oh, he's he's coming back. Agamemnon's he's pissed kick. that he's lost Sparta. So if we this would be cool to see him reclaim it. Oh, they've gone over there. That's why. That's why Troy's offensive down here is sort of stopped. Agamemnon still yeah, you still got your four regions over there. It's more fun. Um, to watch you playing this game than playing with. How come? Um, for I mean, I'm glad you're enjoying me playing the game. You just don't understand it, or you just not don't feel you're, you're that good, or you you just prefer watching somebody else play. Or is it that you're better than me, and you like watching the noobs play? <laughs> Honestly, don't mind. Hey, at the end of the day, if you're enjoying watching me watching me play the game, that's uh, that's all I can. Ever asked Favored or cursed, I know the difference. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna upgrade that port. That's what I'm gonna do. You <laughs> To upgrade that when we can. My experience. People just like to be kept informed. Minus one. Yeah, minus one influence. And over here, 75. That's good. Honk! Thank you for redeeming the uh, the goose channel point redeem. I mean, technically, I should change it to swan, shouldn't I? What, oh, it's we did we did goose because we were playing Magic the Gathering and there was a war goose, and I went honk, and then people were like, "Have a channel point redeem for that." Honk. Uh, you want bronze? I say no. Soz. He's back, and he's going to claim some regions. Oh, and he's got Agamemnon helping out. I wonder, though, if uh, Agamemnon will sneak in and grab Sparta. <laughs> Medes. Um, playing as Argos. You want a barter agreement? You all want me bronze. No. It's more swan. Honk! It's a, it's a, it's a nod to... Um, Hot fuzz. Swans escaped. Honk. <laughs> but go goose, ge goose, geese, they honk too, right? Ooh. That order resolve. I'm not sure I trust that. What do you reckon, Twitch chat? Risk the order resolve or fight it? Fight. 
Gollum in the Trojan Hall. You want me to say Gollum in the Trojan Hall or, or Gollum inside what Gollum would say inside the Trojan Halls? Shadow War Chief. Right, quick save to test the order itself. Less yesterday I lost this position by auto. Yeah, I do think is that's something you always have to get used to with each total war is like how how accurate or Oh, how balanced or unbalanced the order resolve is based on its prediction. Second, the quick save order resolve. Uh, yeah, I, I don't. Th I don't think it's not much of a save scum. This is more of an experiment to say to find out how how accurate or not it is. Let's find out. It says. It says. Oh no! It says it'll be a, a close victory. Okay, so when we go to that, it says close victory. Okay, so that's worth noting. Do that. Predicted enemy casualties high, ours will be medium. Yeah, a pirate never runs away unless they be wrong. What Gollum would say inside the Trojan horse. Master, what's this wooden horse, is there? What, what's we doing in here, sneaking into cities, precious? Up, 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 up the horse we go, and then into the city, precious. And then he jumps out and kills all the Trojans. That's Gollum and a Trojan horse for you. Poison the well success. So good, okay. Boom. That's all good. Um, right, we're raiding. We're now going to start sieging the city. Whoa! Oh, I totally didn't even... I Yeah, that's my mistake. Retreat. I skipped through all those... Yeah, I've skipped through the messages. Poison the well. Oh, my army! It's in bits! Force march back. We've got to replenish. Ah! No! I disagree, devil. I think it's in a decent release state, to be honest. I don't, I don't see how it's quite early access. I mean, it all functions as intended, I believe. You know, might be a bit squiffy with the battle collision, but compared to some early access titles, I, I can't really see this as a as a comparison. Uh, standing idle. I don't think that... Yeah, no, I'm going to save your points, aren't I? Are you what guys wants to David Attenborough inside a Trojan horse? Oh, good God. <sighs> um, yeah, we'll do that in a sec. We'll do it once we're going through the intern phase. Let me just boost the Zeus. Uh, Hecatomb in one more turn. And then I think we won't need to ever do it again. I mean, we probably don't need to now. What we are going to do here is get me a Minotaur. So, in fact, actually, we'll attack that city with our new army. Yes. That's going to be fun. Sell, 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 sell. Great. Deeds await. We should, I mean, I know what we're going to do for this series. Tim, the Minotaur. We've got our Tim for the series. Job done. Always with honor. Otherwise, he's just called a Minotaur. Have patience. Can I reach that next turn? No, I need to force March, apparently. So hopefully, they, let's hope they don't get another success. I feel like agents more. need a cooldown. They need a cooldown. Beefy Tim. <laughs> oh dear. Minnow Tim. <laughs> we'll uh, we'll tweak we'll tweak him, but yeah, for now Tim. Old Timmy's in there. Right, yeah. Oh we can get that in the air. Oh no, that oh, I got excited thinking that's food, but it's not as bronze. Where somewhere where I've got food I can upgrade. I swear. Is it this one? Oh, I'm already, I'm already up, I'm already upgrading it, up doing it. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. I just thought there was another one. Oh, it's this one. Yeah, we need. Oh, we just need more of everything. I might, I might save my resources for a turn. Oh, food is in trouble. How much longer until that other one is done? Two more turns, then we'll be fine. Plus, also port. Okie dokie. 
Thermalism, thank you very much for scoring with tier one sub. <laughs> Cheer off your face. Right. You wanted Sir David in a... In a Trojan horse, describing it. Okie dokie. All right, let's just leave my spy here so I can see what's going on. So, I find myself, after many weeks, inside the mighty Trojan horse. Some say this is the creation of the gods to distract the Trojans and reward them for their fight against the Greeks. But in actual fact, it is the cunning of the Greeks themselves to sneak their forces into the city of Troy, where they shall then spring forth at the opportune moment and slaughter all the Trojans while they sleep or lie drunk in the streets from their celebrations. I, for one, will be staying in the Trojan horse. I care not for the slaughter of men. Honk! There you go. Fiery ice cubes. Uh, they want... They're, they're desperate for peace. No. Fleet-footed royal recruits. Dawn, poison the well. Ah, oh, no! Stop poisoning my well! That's You've ruined my new army! You booger! By the numbers. Can you do anything to kill him? No. Who are you? Okay, yeah, that, that spy needs to go die. Um... Oh, we can get another spy. I can't get another priestess. What? There's only one per temple. That makes sense. Oh, it's only plus one. Oh, that's... I I could have sworn it said earlier we got another one from that. Is that plus one capacity for priestesses from Temple of Zeus's? Like, so you could have, you could have four Temple of Zeus's, but you'd only ever get three capacity from those temples if you then built temples to another uh, god would you be able to get three three more agents being op honestly kind of doesn't surprise me <laughs> always goes a bit goes a bit wrong mine is 20 success chance of enemy agent actions to this character um yeah success chance of agent actions sort of incapac incapacitating enemy characters this chance of incapacitating yeah let's go for this one and we got Messenger of Thunder again. Yeah, good, good, good. So we'll bring you over to harass. Thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, long Kalut. Much appreciated. Cheerio <laughs> for your face. I imagine hearing Sir David's speech slightly muffled and a few bewildering soldiers. Best redeem ever. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I do enjoy it. You need to go die, Spike. Because you're ruining my armies. Uh, in fact, I was going to swap these guys over, wasn't I? So, Odysseus, you actually get a nice new shiny army. Although, I might keep the cavalry for you. Ooh, they go to different colours at rank 4, do they? That's interesting. Um, so, yeah, pop all of you guys over. That's too many. I need to get rid of one unit of something. Um, So, I can fit in the cav. Actually, you know what? I'll leave, I'll leave the cav. I'll leave the cav. And then you've got something Heading fast out. moving. So Odysseus, you go in there. You're gonna take three turns to replenish Rodi Ek. Your cause is mine. You guys in camp. Hmm, do we get more in camping than we do Words in the city? Win through. Might in camp him next turn. See if that does anything different. You ask the impossible. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I have a plan. Yeah, we're just letting your points stack up because I don't. There's nothing I want to upgrade you right now. Du, 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 du. Agent not moved. Yeah, because I want to see what Menelaus is doing. Okay, he's reclaiming that. Let's go see what happens at Sparta. Just like an observer over here. Uh, our food problem is going to be fine next turn, so we won't actually go negative. At least I don't think. Anyway, I won't do your action though, just in case. We'll get more wood from there. Um. I can. I would want to Hecatomb, but we don't have enough resources. So we'll Hecatomb next turn, and then we won't ever need to Hecatomb with Zeus again as long as we keep that Priestess up. That's good. Uh, okay, let's end the turn. Oh, oh, help me. I'm 
been kidnapped by a gigantic wooden horse. Quickly, man, get me out of here. This thing has eaten me, and I'm now being kidnapped by it because I was throwing rocks at it. Oh no, I mean, I'm Sir David Attenborough. I study nature. So, I have actually just been studying this large horse and have coincidentally fallen in. Now, please, get me out. Uh, stronghold ended... Uh, stronghold ended two hours ago. Souls. Do, 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 do. Uh, Bartle agreement. No. I'm just going to quickly change my Twitch title to get rid of the Troy command because it is no longer free. You will have to buy it. There we go. Uh, stream ends in three. No, I don't know. I don't know why it's so. Why the stream element spot does that? It is definitely. We're not. We're going for another hour today. You guys want Pete? Ah, no, you're gonna die. Stop hitting my armies with your spy, though. Oh, finally, a spy's moving away. Yeah, but Alas, it seems like they've got no cooldown. Definitely bare. needs a cooldown. Search out new sources of wealth at once, or an assistant. Or risk losing all no, you have achieved. rely on fishing. We'll be fine. Minus five happiness. It's okay. Portents are no mystery to me. Go, Spike, go. Right, let's see. Currently in the city, these guys are going to... They're replenishing 46 per turn. It's going to take three turns to replenish. Ithaca's Lord. In camp, 52. So, yeah, it's better to have them in in camp stance than a city. Interesting, that. That's actually... That's interesting to know, because previously, I think you'd get better replenishment in a city. So, I guess maybe if there's a building in there which increases it, that's good. What time is it over here in BST? It is uh, It is two... Uh, six minutes past two p.m. EST. Yeah, and we'll go hit that city. Both armies. Not who? Who are you? What are you? Why are you wandering through? Are you a wandering faction? Are oh, you a settler seeking new lands? Drives this one ever forward. So they've got some lands over there. And they've gone. They're going to go settle somewhere. They've got three. Interesting. Quick deal. Let's have a look. Thinner. Athens. They want some, some of that. Um, I see they want defensive alliance. I mean, you're getting attacked by pretty much everyone. Um, I don't want to just yet. Because I mean, more... Ooh, really? You guys... I say the interesting thing as well. If you confederate, do you suddenly get all of their resources added to yours? How does that work? I'm guessing not. That would be crazy. Thanks, Mendel. Uh, Divine, yeah, we can't do a Hecatomb just yet. Menelaus, yeah, moving to reclaim Sparta. To I'm actually quite happy to see the AI um, pushing to reclaim the settlement actually kind of recovering from this because it looked they were down to one settlement. They managed to hold on. That's good, because normally, you know, when you knock, knock the AI down that far, they're normally down now. Okay, it's because Hector didn't press press on, but they actually managed to fortify their remaining settlements fairly well, which was impressive. Minus 10% uh, bronze upkeep for all units this army. Sweet, touched by Hephaestus. That's useful. With sword and with wit. Victory awaits. One more turn for you guys. Where's their spy? He's built up seven, that's the thing. I might have to... Hmm. I, need, I could both go in with both armies and have a big old siege. Oh, 
Oh, I, I'm kind of tempted to wait for them to ambush, but no, I think we're going to have to press. We'll just press with both armies. Uh, we'll press. We'll press next turn. I will. Set up camp. No, we won't be completely at full strength, but we'll be at enough. My weapons are key. We can cause attrition to the garrison. Yeah, we'll want to try and do that. It's only 15, uh, 50 percent. What about taking out that 10 percent chance to assassinate? Don't know where their spy's gone. Battle will be the last thing on their minds. I know they're probably going to replenish straight away. I can't actually see how badly wounded they are. That is not possible. But I can yeah, give it a go. Any problem, go away. Why do I give heck dooms to Zeus? Only Zeus. Oh well, only because he's the easiest that I can kind of keep. I can keep up with at the moment. I'm gonna. Are we gonna? Can we? Oh, that was only gonna give us. So 650 is the limit, is it? Oh. Worship 600 to 650. Okay. Ah, so that is. No, I can still. I can still top it up. Mm. No. Uh. A sacred uh. That. Okay. Yeah, that is to stop you doing what I was trying to do there, which was raise it high enough that the minus 10 per turn would never. Ah, uh, so I'd counter it with her. I serve the good. The 25. The I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have done that actually. Yeah, because that's just going to reset to the same thing. I should have. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's getting to trait and to level up. Um, a favor from Athena. <laughs> we want to go for the service of Zeus to increase favor there. So when we get to that level, then she can keep it topped up. But yeah, I was trying to get it like to 680 or 700. So then when it came down each turn, we'd permanently boost it over. So we'd never have to worry about it dropping from worship to celebrated as we want. I mean, it gives us the Minotaur, doesn't it? Is that the only... You can only ever get one of each of those um, special units, I'm assuming. Inspired by heavenly power. Because there's no other way to get the Minotaur. Cash replenishment of all armies. So yeah, who do we want to go for next? Um, so yeah, we went for Zeus because Javs. Ares is for sword and axe units. Uh, we probably... Athena will do spears and defense unit of shielded units. Which, and it does melee attack of them as well. Athena kind of doubles up for us nicely because we've Great got deeds, shields on all of them couple of spears but with uh, Odysseus we've got a lot more spears in there now I think that's where we'll go next we'll start going through Athena uh, yeah we'll pop the prayer to Aphrodite May my words find divine... happiness and growth whenever any tech to reduce favour decay I don't think so I think it's always 10 tech to live stream is every Monday On Twitch, follow is basically subscribe on YouTube. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. On Twitch, follow is a YouTube subscribe. And a subscribe on Twitch is a YouTube channel membership. So yeah, follow is the free option. <laughs> if that helps. Um, mm. That's growth and happiness. Battle captive taken. Organized games. Yeah, we'll go for Athena. So when we take that, we'll put a Temple of Athena in there, I'd have thought. You crash it every time you reach turn 20. With which hero? All of them? Has Paris lost Helen? Yes. Paris sailed back to Greece, um, took a couple of settlements from, from the Greeks over here, uh, and then lost it to uh, to Agamemnon. But he brought Helen over to be close to her, to him, using that mechanic that he has. So it, Helen was there. And, uh, yep. Menelaus got it. Although it looks like they're under siege, because there's fire. That doesn't look like just regular torches. There's torches there. Is that is that under siege? I think so, maybe. I don't know. 
They've got... Oh, they've got that. Maybe it's just... Hmm. No, maybe it's just ambient stuff. I know, it might just be regular torches. I thought it might be under siege. I kind of like it, though. It shows the AI is utilizing his mechanic, though, because his mechanic is to move Helen around and to keep her close for maximum benefit. So that's that's quite funny. Flesh. Achilles, uh, you want a single bar to 99 and you're going to give me some food. That doesn't seem like a great deal. I'm not going to lie. Uh, if you give me way more food, though, I'll actually do it. What happens if Hector recalends? Uh, re, re, recalends? Blah, 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 words. What happens if Hector captures Helen? Does he just give her back to Paris? I don't know, actually. I'm not actually sure. I assume you. I think any whoever holds Helen gets some kind of bonus. But Paris is the one that benefits most. Ambush is discovered. Hector. Yeah, that's him. Oh, he's pushed Menelaus. Oh, he's defeated Menelaus. He's come back from pushing over here. Priam's heir. Dun dun dun. Rip Menelaus. But he has been able to reclaim his settlements. And yeah, blue blue background means they're allied. Um, grey means they're neutral, and red background means they're enemies. For those wondering about the how to tell what's going on. I, yeah, I kind of... I feel like the, maybe the faction banner could be a bit bigger. Make love, not war. That's what my gaffer used to say. So yeah, Hector holds Sparta. Yeah. But, GG to Menelaus for reconquering Tura's regions. And he's still got this army, which has renowned Laconian Axemen. Shielded spearmen, heavy sword skirmishers. He might be okay. If I pause matrician, try and help him out. I'll I'll meddle against Hector. I know it's probably gonna upset him because we're not at war. But hey ho. My shady skills are yours. My work requires a strong constitution. I could try and ambush you, but yeah, you know what I'm going to do? Because we'll go take that. Divinely blessed. Decius, I want to see your new units in action. You have none there. Oh. Well, we can have we can have a quick little slaughter. Let's go and reclaim that. Not an option. Meanwhile, you guys. Get into go into cover. ambush stance here and hope they head towards you Do not concern yourself with my methods poison the well suffer the army to cause attrition yeah I could do that Keep her, if not we'll just harass their garrison and then we'll bring both armies over and have a big old battle there I think more food more food, more food, more food. Yep, yep, yep. I beseech the gods. So four turns and then we start hecatuming Athena. Can you play as preem? Uh no. Can't play as preem. A little knowledge is a Hector or Paris. Keep them happy enough. Keep all units. This chance. Uh, settlements. I mean, we have 100% anyway. Influence. Faction own settlement. Yeah, we'll do that one. You may wish to reconsider. Keep boosting that influence. 
upgrade that one as well. And then have a little looky. What's going on over here? Hey Spyro, how you doing, dude? Did you see the settlement on the far southwestern part of the map? Uh, I did not. Building constructed, logger's house. Nice. Oh, he's brought his other army up. Eager for action. Oh, but now I can't do anything to help you out. Meet Hades. Uh, oh. um, let's stop these guys coming to help out. Um, at least cause them to suffer attrition or try. Success. Nice. You're welcome, Sparta. Why is it always nighttime? It cycles. There's a day night cycle. But yeah, far southwestern part of the map. Oh. Oh, they've got. Oh, I did not see that. That's held by, held by, uh, um, Pylos. Ah. Huh. That's cool. That's the first time I've actually looked that far down and be like, oh, look, there's something down there. Cool. Thanks for the heads up. Yeah, so now it's, now it's, uh, we're going through night into day and you'll see the, the background of the game as well change from stars to, to day. Stars will fade. Well oh, where'd the army go? Where'd the army go? I your oh, there's their spy. They're at war with other people, aren't they? That's why. That's probably why. Yes. That is why. The shadowing hand. Which means I'm going to go in and siege. It's a big garrison, though. Uh, that's actually what I should do. Sorry, Get break back. the siege. Try and... Uh, attrition them. Damn it, failed. Oh, now I can't hit it again. Dang it! See if their army comes back. It's a slam dunk, but I really do want to see some of these units in action. So let's really quickly dive in. We don't need all of our troops. Chariots. Actually, chariots should be fun. See how many kills we can get with them. Let's try out the chariots. Mow the enemy down. I want the rest of the units, though, to have a good old look at them. It's the first time we have seen some of them in action. But we'll have a bigger, proper battle soon, I'm sure. We'll send the giants forward. They're fun. The Minotaur. There he is. Take a look at these spears. Sons of Achaea. I like that the prerequisite for this unit is that you must all have a solid beard. No good beard, no joining. Foes My heavy beware. swords. And then we've got the spears the other side, haven't we? Spear runners. Spears! At your command! Oh. And then, yeah, giants. Giant. Giants. These big, big boys. Don't mess with them. Okay. Ushabti. Oh, these are the only ones I'm using. Giants! 
They've got chariots. You. Maximum speed. Well, that chariot got wrecked going into the spears. That's because they're shielded spearmen, which is fine. Makes sense. Going through those boys. Oh, yeah, they hit them at that side. Yeah, the giants have just wrecked them. Minotaur. Tramples enemy units. Bull rush. Uh, he's unable to attack. Uh, I'll just have a draw. The beards unite. Yeah. Oh, wow. He's doing massive damage. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Mow them down, chariot. Whip them. Give them a good lashing. Those are huge bows. Oh. Tearing them up. Hopefully he doesn't lose chariots like he uses his cab. Yeah, no, I, from my own, like, play with them, unless you use, I, I you probably need, like, the heavier spears to stop them properly. Otherwise, chariots tend to just mow through units. What's my real opinion on the game? Uh, I wasn't giving out a not real opinion before. <laughs> uh, 7 out of 10. Great campaign. Battles need some work, but are functional. Uh, I don't like that there's not multiplayer at launch. That, that should be in, really. I know Total War games are primarily single player, but it would be nice for them to invest in that a bit. Um, lead copper arrows. Nice ancillary gain. That for... It's an equipment piece, isn't it? Yeah, we've already got lead arrows. So we'll need to give that to you. Always with honor. Yeah, there we go. Right, you stay there. That should sort out public order quite nicely. Get the wood going. High influence bonus. Always with honor. Yeah, I mean, if there's anything specific you want to know, um, known prisoner. Because yeah, off the top of my head, kind of midstream, kind of sort of hard. I should probably bullet point down my kind of key thoughts and stuff. Unit variety so far, um, it seems fairly decent. I mean, it's not going to be crazy, uh, you know, cra crazy variety levels, but each faction seems to have a decent number of unique units, um, which which works. Uh, yeah, I didn't really want any of those, did I? I just wanted to save her points now as well. Got to save for Zeus at tier 8. Uh, how is... Oh, we can tier XP there. No, that's a movement range. XP rank there. There we go. Yeah, am I going to make a YouTube video on the game? Uh, what, a let's play or review? I don't tend to do dedicated video reviews. It's just... I'm not just one for making review videos. Um, I've got plenty of let's plays though my talent can advance your plan people just like to be critical success beautiful it's leveling him up there all the time I don't know if we're really actually doing that much with him yeah, pop all that in get all that built I can build that if we had enough gold. 
and enough stone and wood. That's kind of a slight issue, the tooltip hovering up. It covers the amount of resources you need. I guess, I don't know, it does tell you on the left, but on the tooltip there. That's not ideal. Yes, you can be Agamemnon. He's one of the playable factions. I watched uh, Troy again last night on uh, Netflix. Was great. Success chance for spy actions. Yes, please. Hey, Pongo. How you doing? Oh. Another army of Hector appearing. Yeah, he's got a lot of forces. He's putting... Menelaus under a fair bit of pressure. Oh, he's taken he's taken Phylos out. Might have to go help out. I feel like I'm I should I should do something here. I should intervene. Because they're gonna siege him down at Sparta, would they need both armies to do that? I don't know if he's my spy. You guys are up here. No. Okay, they brought their army back, but that it's much weaker now. Work. My work requires a strong constitution. Those yes. Good. We attrition them. Sure right. Attack. Leave none alive. Definitely going to get some rams. Ooh, they've got a separate gate that way. That would be cool. Yeah, I might, I might even get four rams. I don't know if we want to split our troops up that much. Them having bowmen, though. I kind of feel like we still probably want Odysseus to come on over as well, just to really over. If we're gonna go for, if we're gonna split our force up, actually, yeah, that's fine. By the time he's built all that, Odysseus is gonna be over here. Uh, he's got another point. Um, gift Hermes plus ten percent campaign movement range of this hero's army when on land. Uh, we're at sea. Went on land as well. Now we'll go for the one that does land and sea. That one's provide new stance grants here at chance. Ooh, oh no. Oh no, we're going for the shadow. Gift of Hermes is nice, but the shadow stance, even better. This is... <laughs> I do love this. Odysseus is actually Skaven, because this gives him the Skaven ambush stance when he attacks them. Yes. <laughs> oh dear. Prevents enemy casualty replenishment in local enemy region. What, so they can't replenish with that? That's insane. But yeah, we've now got the shadow stance. Um... <laughs> oh dear. Chance for ambushing enemy army this force attacked. Impossible. With sword and with wit. That's crazy. Land ahoy. I'm assuming that doesn't cost us anything. Yes. Yeah. Amazing. We'll but we'll force march to get over there. He's a Lethan R. I don't know, with the with the safe havens, he's he's totally scaven. Poison the well. Even the greatest ah, failure. Weaknesses. Well, their garrison might be able to hold. Oh, Menelaus is back. I'll not falter. Garrison's. I assume when it's when it's yellow, it means they're not at full strength. Troy's finest warrior. Is that army in range? I kind of feel like you need to move in a little bit closer. How's Etis' garrison? Eh, might be able to hold him off. What shit? What you've got something special? You got a shield? Oh, you got you've taken Menelaus's shield. <laughs> oh, it's like me and Hector all over again, losing the sword. He still got his sword and his armor. It will be epic. Definitely choosing that skill when this campaign gets to that point. Yeah, gold, glorious gelt, gold, gelt, probably. Yeah, gelt be well up for that. Uh, how is our influence over here? Probably could, could do with improving it. Because you're fine. Although, is my character improving things here? Uh, no. I can be Sail you over. Spread our influence. Voyage is complete.
this is the final book. No, it's the, it's the final release build. Game came out yesterday. Oh, they... And where was that? They attacked and won. Oh, over here. Oh, they've broken Menelaus. No! Menelaus, I wanted you to be victorious. I want to send an army down to help you out, aren't I? Damn it. Just want those Spartans to do one thing. One thing. I mean, it's a pretty close thing. They keep kind of coming back and it's very close. But they brought up another army. It's too much. No, because you're on my wall list next. Complete footed uh, resilience plus 50% to melee defense of all light infantry units. Sweet, which means we're finally going for minus 10% upkeep, uh, upkeep cost reduction. Perfect. Right. It shall be so. Let's do it. Oh, I can't wait to do his uh, his attack there. His shadow stance, yeah. Oh, we could split our forces. Experience. Should we help out Menelaus? That's the question. <laughs> Should we begin our war against the Trojans? I was, I mean, we we decided to go for the uh, where was it? No rash bravery. You can sustain your hesitation to march. Yeah, so are they, are they going to at some point be like, hey, are you going to come and take part in this war or not? Or is that it? That's what I want to know. Right. We'll finish things up today. Probably with this battle. Although that is very much auto resolvable. Um, fight or auto then. Twitch chat. We'll keep, if we if we auto resolve, we'll keep playing for another. We'll keep playing for a bit longer, obviously. No, you want to fight it. <laughs> auto, auto. Oh, does it hide his army for am in ambush as well? That's crazy. Auto, no fun to watch cross units. Auto, auto, a little bit of fight. Auto, balls. We will, we will have to fight the siege against the army and the 17 stack garrison in the north. I kind of feel that as much as I want to go after Hector and restore Sparta. I am going to finish up my plan at least, of at the very least, sailing on up with both my armies to take out these guys that I'm at war with. We could leave this lot till later, and then we could go after Hector, but I feel like we're at war with them, we should finish them off. And just use my spy to harass as much as possible, but they could start crumbling pretty hard. Got three regions there. We'll check on Diplomacy, see if he's got anywhere else. If that's all he's got, then maybe we will have to go help him out. Uh, we gained the pelt of the uh, Caledonian bear. Cool. Not bear, sorry, boar. Minus 10% to recruitment cost of missile units. This army and plus 10% to the morale of own missile units. They're destroyed. Is the Battle of Troy a scripted event? Not that I'm aware of, no. <laughs> That's a boar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's have a look at diplomacy for Sparta. So hmm, those are his only three. Oh, I probably should come and help you out, shouldn't I? <sighs> Which means I could accept the peace treaty that this guy keeps asking me. Are we going to be good guys, Sean Bean, and go help out Sparta? I might take... Hmm, how about all of that? Hmm. Arcadia. Well, actually, if we if we took Pylos and we could trade that with the Arcadians for that settlement, I think. I don't know if that would work because that's... Uh, no, mm, that possibly wouldn't because we'd need... They would have one adjacent to it, which is that one, but I don't think it can be the one that you're trading to. Unless it's that one. Oh, it can't, oh no, that counts. That's. Oh, no, it's that one. Damn it. Help them, Troy tr must fall. Take land, then make another army so you can have three. Yeah, we... 
You are suffering a little bit. The old Victory food there. Awaits. Death levels all. Problem is, I can't I can't defeat these guys without two armies because if they're going to sit in there with an army, a full stack and a seventeen stack garrison, I need two forces to take it. That'll be a nice big siege. Otherwise, I was going to go after these guys, but I probably need two armies to deal with them because they're allied to this lot as well. Need to help the other Greeks. Yeah, I kind of feel like I should help. Glory beckons. <laughs> I did want to complete this province though by grabbing that. Well if I take this, I'm not going to Troy. I'm turning back around and going back up. Destroy the north, then help. Then you won't get backstabbed. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I could piece up. I could piece up with them if I wanted to. Your cause is mine. Odysseus the cunning. Nine percent speed during ambushes. <laughs> Herb or Prevent enemy casualty replenishment in local enemy region. That seems like crazy good to stop them replenishing. Let's do that. Get the north, then go fight the Trojans. You've got to save Menelaus if for story reasons, if nothing else. Yeah. Just kind of the constant turning, having to turn back around. You need the food on the coast up the north. The gold is nice too. That's true. I don't know if we can bring back factions if they're completely wiped out. That's the thing. I mean, Kithara is fairly well defended. Courage and might. Challenge awaits. You may find. Critical success. Noise. Yeah, they're ruined. There's no way you can take that settlement just on your own, mate. Keep the spy messing with Hector. What's the point of joining the Grand Armada to avenge Menelaus is on it? If he's already had his ass handed to him by Hector, that is very true. Yeah, um, they brought Helen. Oh, he's taken... Oh, he's taken Corinth. Menelaus, uh, sorry, Agamemnon's getting big. Seven settlements. He's starting to get a, becoming a big Greeky boy. You really might want to help out your uh, your brother, Agamemnon. Just a thought. Teeny tiny thought. Keep the spy messing with Hector. Yeah. In Ares' service. How long is it going to take me to get up there? Well, we've got to head. We've got to head this way to go to the sea anyway. Courage and might. So we'll see how the next turn goes for Menelaus. With Ares, we can go for recruit rank of all new units. We can go for ammunition for you missile units this hero's army. Uh, missile resistance. A reload of missile resist uh, units. Yeah, formation specialist. That's what I went with before. That's good. Missile units are very strong. In this one, uh, another spy to really mess with, uh, mess with the Trojans. Yeah, let's do it. Although actually having you to help with the siege probably also useful. Um, chance of success by actions. Yeah, diligent. So, in fact, send you this way. I mean, they're, they're moving out towards the garrisons. If they're just on their own, they will get defeated. But if Hector moves as well like that, he's going to take it. Have they just raised it? That one moved away. That one's going back or mustering. They're building up more forces over there. They might be okay. They're down to two units. 
So the auto resolve smashed that one a bit. Uh, Ionia, you want bronze. You want that much bronze for that much wood. No. What's this? Oh, bandits, the same. Crush them. Plus five happiness owned settlement at the cost of 200 bronze and 1,000 food. Or rally the people. Oh, that hits resources in that region in growth. Or we lose gold, send an emissary. Cost of all light infantry. Or leave them alone. Uh, no, we'll we'll crush them. We can afford to crush them. Upkeep cost. Yeah, boom. Food is fine now. Uh, melee attack, fleet footed might, or light infantry unit, construction cost of buildings. Where do we want to go next? Where do we want to go? So I feel like honoring our blood. Or we share uh, armor of all units. Can we get any more gold? No, I guess that would be a bit too OP. Having all that gold. Plus 5% campaign map movement range of all armies. Marching drills. Yeah, let's do that. So we'll go through speed. That'll speed. Power of our missile units a bit more as well. <laughs> 69 food income per turn. Food is fine. Yeah, and they raised it. If they take if they take it next turn, it's like, oh, good to see that Warhammer AI in that. I can be most useful. Too sick to I don't understand why they didn't think shit. putting a cooldown on these agent actions should be a thing. Because again, from Warhammer, agents totally have cooldowns. Being able to do this every single turn is just bonkers right now. I imagine that's gonna get patched up pretty soon. Uh, Egyptian herb expert. Yeah, so enjoy the, uh, the ability to just nuke armies every single turn. Well, attempt to anyway. But at least the percentage the is only 50%, place. I guess, rather than it being higher. Is there any city that gives me gold? No. I want to get that one from the Arcadians, but... Okay, we're, we're going we're gonna to try and go for the north, then go after go help Menelaus, because he seems to be holding for the moment. It's a risk. But it's a risk we're going to take. We might also have a rebellion here when we leave. But it's a risk I'm going to take. <laughs> I just want to get this war done. Then Menelaus. Then we go to Menelaus. That's the plan. That's the plan. That's the plan. That's the plan. Oh, okay, I need to do a Hecatomb, don't I? Zeus is fine. Uh, Athena is who we're going to Hecatomb to. Hecatomb! Morale spear units. Aphrodite. Growth and happiness. Although immunity, deep sea attrition. Poseidon, yeah, we'll do that because we're bringing our armies up through the water. And I was like, oh yeah, that's where I'm going to build my next, um, my next temple. Nope. It's going to have to probably be up here because we need it to be uh, a coastal settlement so we can actually build in it besides the mainline building tree. Because we are Odysseus and that's our thing. Guys in Hector's army, bro, don't drink from the well. It's probably poisoned again. Yep. Oh, look, Mycenae's here. Agamemnon comes. Agamemnon is coming. Helping out his bro. Good. It means I don't have to. It means I can kill this guy who keeps desperately trying to peace out with me. Cost of stone and timber. Minus 3% construction, construction cost of all buildings. Right. But you are slightly risking Menelaus being able to reclaim Sparta. He might take it from you. Where has Hector gone? Or did these guys perhaps take out Hector on their march down? I Looks like it. Let's poison this well. Again. Yeah, don't drink from the well. 
You feel Greeks or Trojans are stronger? Uh, I mean, so far I've played two Greek campaigns, one Trojan. Um, I've played more of the Greeks than I have the Trojans. Uh, I'll, I'll let you know on Monday once I've played more Hector. <laughs> I think that's when I can kind of safely say one way or the other. Spy, 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 spy. Go. At least we know where to land this time. Go, 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 go. We'll definitely fight that siege. Even even if they've moved their other army out, I want to I wanna have a siege. Probably have to be next stream, though, because we're just going to get up there, but we'll see. Under divine protection. I'll keep them happy enough. Oh, yeah. What about over here? That probably needs, yeah, influence. So I'll send you over there next. Uh, you're going to go for... Oh, you're not going to go for that. You're going to go for the Siren's Cove so we can get Sirens. The uh, mythical slingers. <laughs> like I said, hero of the story, says Mendel Bean about Agamemnon. Yeah, I would imagine agents having a cooldown is definitely going to get... I mean, because, well, it's the spy, because she's got a cooldown. The priestess got a cooldown on her ability. She can't just keep spamming it out. I don't know about the, the envoy can do it every single turn. The envoys and spies look like they need to be given some... Uh, some cooldowns. Single bar for military access. Spirit. Yeah, I'm okay with that, because you're going to give me a lot of gold. 286. Let's just see if I can get more out of a barter agreement. No, we can get we can get teeny tiny bit more by going for 29. Uh, in fact, we might even be able to... Oh, trade regions, what can I do? That one, right? No? Oh, that one over there. Yeah, no, I don't want that. Um, single barter. 1, 2, 5, 10, 20, 30, 29, 28, 27, 6, 5. There we go. Perfect. Give me all that gold. bring a portable island with you. I, I, I don't know if you're, you're not bringing an island with you. You're more like going, oh, hello there with your big armada of ships. Uh, I see some islands over there. Let us be civil, disembark from our ships, and then fight on those islands. <laughs> with it's ever so civil. Coming ashore. I mean, if only I, I want to do an ambush as well. Immediately. Flesh. Is weak. They'll be begging to be conquered. Your cause is mine. Go, 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 go. Oh, come on, you can totally get on land. Not until next turn, apparently. Hagglehart added again. Yep. Every day I'm haggling, haggling. Okay, Hector's back. The great protector. Why does his portrait look a bit it looks like he's got cracks through it? We're not under siege, though. Well, that's like Agamemnon himself. Uh, you accept that. You're on your own. Uh, you've got an army of five behind. Be and Menelaus dead. is here with Laconian uh, swordsmen. You've claimed that, though. And they're sieging uh, Phylos. So it looks like you're all good. Uh, I'll help you out once more with another poison in the well. Ah, uh, it failed. They didn't drink from it this time. Have fun. Yeah, that one's gone there to go reclaim it. That's nice. Lost his shield, has he? No oh, idea. Oh, Hector's lost his sword, though. So not just, it's not just me that loses the sword. It's the AI as well. I want to know what, what is cracked. Cracked symbol means. Uh, let's have a look to see. Is he like he's, He lost all his other territory. No, he's still got, he's still got seven. So he's just going to go back over there. 
Hmm. Back again. Hector's back. Tell a friend. Hector's back. Hector's back. Hector's back. <laughs> oh dear. One more turn there. Uh, Athena can't act two or three more turns. Your Zeus is going to drop down, so we will lose that buff. That's okay, so we need to hack to Zeus for a bit. Um, no, don't go all the way up there, sorry. Go here. Disembarking now. Contented citizens are Critical success. Ah -da! Increasing by 2.4%. Noise. Um, For duty. I've got the one in here that we're still waiting to level up, aren't we? Yep. For level four as well. Uh, but I am using you on the campaign map. So that's fine, Mr. Envoy. I could do, yeah, province or uh, plus 10% to all resources. Yeah, uh, what's that do? Resting a foreign spy. Uh, dedicated subject, let's go for that. And then I need to, if I look through provinces, uh, I'll sort it by income of food. But it, Kefaloni is going to be, yeah, the one where I'll want to send him to to sit there and boost things up. What's Achilles up to? Achilles is... Achilles is... Uh, up over here. He... He's actually doing okay. He's kind of gone up and conquered around there. That's what I... That's what I want to do in my uh, Achilles campaign. So it's actually... He's done exactly the same as me. He's gone to war with the Thessalians. He's gone over that way. And then he's gone round after these guys. He hasn't gone down here, which is what I wanted to do after the uh, Abantes. But yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing with Achilles. Right. One more in turn. Fortunately, we didn't have a, a massive battle today. But we'll be set up nicely to fight at uh, Chariot. Next, Strum. You're demanding that for a non-aggression pact. I say no. Oh, the Arcadians have gone in there as well. Oh, boy. Oh, that would be useful. And if I did go to war with them, trade it with the Arcadians. Take all of that, if we can. No, I want to kill you. But, maybe. Cult level down. No. Bad times. Cult level back up. <laughs> yeah. mm, how many turns? Sec Hecatomb. A little bit longer. That's fine. There's no champions to put in the mil armies for military training, right? Not that I'm aware of, no. Any right, here we go. Away. Here we go. They've got the 20 sack. We We've managed to within. attrition them. Sweet. Increase your movement range. Right. We now go in for the siege with Odysseus. Even weakened they are, formidable. What's their city look like? Ooh, multiple tiers. Yeah, we'll get four rams. Continue the siege. And then we'll bring our army up. They might, they might, what if they feel about World sallying out? No, we've got, to, we've got to force march. They will That's even. That is even. Engage the foe. Interesting. What hero do you like to play as the most at the moment, or do you want to try out? Or do you want to try out more to really be able to tell that? Um, yeah, I'd probably need to try out more. I mean, of the three I'm doing, I've played the most of Odysseus. So at the moment, I'd probably say I'm enjoying Odysseus the most, but that's just because I've had the most playtime with him. Um, yeah, chuck that in there. More food. What's happened? Uh, oh, they haven't. Why? What? What? Why did no one take Sparta? Did Hector survive? And why is he not cracked anymore? I'll win or die I have no idea what's going on in the intern phase at Sparta. It's mental. Sparta, maybe it's... Oh, the garrison's gone up to... They must have just upgraded. That's why. They're just batting them back every time. Well, I will keep trying to poison the well, damn it. Critical success. Enjoy a very weakened Sparta, guys. I wish you could see how what their health was at. I'm doing my best here with this spike. Hey, 
Hey Andy, how you doing? How doth the new game go? The new game doth be good. Much fun. Top enjoyment so far. An outstanding raid by Hector. Yeah, he's Hector's done pretty well going in here and just causing lots of trouble. Um, Kashi, we've got success chance, all actions. Yeah, just increase the success chance, I think. How much enemy buildings, how much gar enemy garrison. Right, go for that aware. More success chance, please. No one wants Sparta. It's too Spartan. <laughs> he threw some Persian ambassadors in the well, it seems. Yeah. No one wants to be in Sparta because the water's deadly because it's constantly poisoned. That's very true. It, don't do not drink from the well of Sparta. As I hope, it's horribly, just horribly like diseased and poisoned. You will have some terrible disease if you drink there. Don't do it. Yeah, we know you're trying to upgrade. I'm waiting for you to get another level or two because um, I don't want to spend your points at the moment. My priestess. I'm, again, I'm holding off. Oh, oh. I'm holding off spending points. <laughs> um, pigeon noises. Until we get to rank eight. So I want to go through Zeus, but actually we can we can spend another point. Prophecy of Doom action. Yeah, I don't really know which one I want to do. No one wish know which one I want to do. I've lost it, clearly. Um, critical success chance of all agent actions. Uh, companion way, minus 10% success chance of enemy actions against this agent. Yeah, let's do that so she can't be taken out. And all, thank you very much for subscribing with a prime sub. <laughs> Chewy, raw, or your face. Right, let's do one more intern, and I think we're going to wrap things up for today's Odysseus stream. But we will be able to open next time with a absolutely massive siege attack. Although, no, it might be... It might not be next... Right at the very start of the next week. It'll be within the first, like, five, ten minutes because we probably need to end turn once more to get extra rams. Uh, you guys want that... I've got a decent amount, but not for that. I'm probably going to... I need to do some more bartering for some resources. Because of the water quality of Sparta, I feel like the property cost uh, drastically goes down. <laughs> yeah. Uh, who's this? Who this? Icus. Uh, you're all with Sparta. Nope. Not going to deal with you guys. Oh, they, they tried to do Prophecy of Doom against me. What does Prophecy of Doom do? What does Doom do do? Oh, and Poseidon's getting angry at Troy again. So he might cause a... Uh, an earthquake. Prophecy of Doom is... Foreign agent prevents character from moving. That's fine. I don't need him to move. I don't need you to move. I want you to die. Fence. Yep. Do that. And that's my spy. Level up this boy. Test chance. Enemy agent action. Surveillance. Yeah, go for surveillance right now. And actually, let's get my spy to try and take her out. Ooh. Positive outcome, 65% though. A swift Damn it. To your troubles. We tried. Spill some blood. So yeah, one more turn and then we'll have all the rams. And then we'll go on in. It's going to be it's gonna be a close battle. Maybe maybe too close. But there's nothing more we can do. We've got, we've got to go for it. Make or break. It's uh, it's going to be a big one, and uh, you know what? Let's let's just Shut get ourselves to that point where we 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 can launch that at at the start of the uh, of the next stream. The master of negotiations. Let us tell the people what they want to hear. Two more turns. Aphrodite prayer. Low on food again. What's going on over here? Yeah, they should be able to take Sparta soon, I thought. But there's Hector. He be chilling. No, don't want to make a safe haven. I'll keep trying to poison the wells. But last end turn of today. I'll wait two turns, there'll be attritioning. 
I could. I could force them to attrition. I feel it would be... Maybe more interesting though just to go for it. I think our units are better than theirs. Once we get up and over the walls, we should be okay. It's just they've got a lot. <laughs> so desperate for peace. Oh no! Hindered. Oh. I think you've just sl you've stopped me moving, in haven't you? Name. I don't think you've actually done anything else. The knife in the dark. The fates cut yeah, that needs a cooldown. Right. Hold so back. next time, going in for the attack, or waiting a turn till the thing is they take they take substantial damage attritioning. So I think from like this turn to next turn, the damage they could potentially take. It would make it an absolute slam dunk order resolve. And I, I think it would be fun to have a big old huge siege. At least give it a go. Oh, what does the order resolve say? It says a uh, Cadmian victory. So we will win, but at high cost. Which I'm not surprised by, to be fair. Not surprised. But yeah, we will open... Probably diving in to fight this battle. So I think if we wait a turn from past experience attritioning uh, garrisons in this game, it does massive damage to them. Um, so it'll probably that would probably swing things well in our favour. Maybe we maybe we want to do that. I don't know. People on YouTube that watched all the way to the end, let me know down in the comment section. If you're watching this on Twitch, feel free to go comment when this ends up on YouTube in a few days' time. Until then, thank you, YouTube viewers. Till the next one. Ciao for now.